Whenever you ready, I can't. The internet. When I tell you, everybody is on the internet. You have to look for her name and function. Yeah, I do. I'm. A, I, I went completely out. I cleared out everything and then came back. I see Safari. Yeah, there it is. Okay, let me go. Go live with. Safari. Did we just freeze? Waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. Waiting and waiting. Uh oh. Hey, connecting was one bar. Safari. Hi. Can you see? Yes, I see you. She had to take a commercial break with the baby real quick. She's coming. That's okay. Well, we got you. So you sit on there because I know we got a lot for you. Come on over here. Now, listen, you know, I had Dr. Oz on earlier in the week, right? And, yeah. uh, and he I talked about, he, he has a lot to say. He has a lot to say. Okay. So we talked about love and relationship and sex and all that stuff. And so we talked about how men are always wanting sex. A lot of times they want sex more than women do. How many times do you think it needs to happen to, to be to make you happy? Does it have to happen every day, or it just need to happen every week? Uh, every, I don't think it got to happen every day. I feel like it's more of like a a fear, in the mood kind of thing. Depends on what's going on in the house. Depends on what's going on in your life. Depends yeah. on depends on if the baby's gonna let you do it or not. <laughs> the baby is young. You can do it. You can do it right now with the baby. When they get older, with like two years old, and they tiptoe in there, that's the problem. Yeah, well, well every, every time the baby starts door. crying and screaming, yeah. she, she leaves me to go to the baby, so I'm left on red. Well, listen, Safari, are you getting up in the middle of the night at least you rocking the baby? You guys are taking turns? No, you ain't. I can tell ah. right now. You lying like hell. You like, mm. no, you ain't. Yeah. You ain't taking no turns. Y'all need to take turns. You don't believe that I get up in the middle of the night and take turns. Oh, my God, yeah. You do that. Greg used to do that, too. You got to do it. I you don't bother with the baby. He goes all the night, and I just get <laughs> I change diapers and all of that. So, listen, check this out. Sorry, what are your sisters thinking? Since you're the only, like, boy, are they loving the baby? Oh, my sisters, they love her. They, they love her they more love than they love me. Yeah. Yes. So I got to tell you, you know, I, I'm, I'm dropping a single on Wednesday. and I have single? To, it's, I'm, I'm rapping in this oh, one now. Oh, oh, Wednesday. Oh, oh. It couldn't drop today because of people are not at work. You know, a lot of people aren't there to be streaming platforms like Shout Out and Apple. And blah, blah. They send us an email saying by Wednesday. So it may be on some places now, it may not be. But what is the name of your single? I just dropped the um, album. It's called Trick. Um... <laughs> songs, 11 with a bonus, and you know, I, I, I was on a crazy promo run to a but then the coronavirus just came and shut everything down, and um, but I'm still working it, I'm still going to be shooting videos and all that kind of stuff. You want to switch sides? Mm -hmm. So who are some of the producers on your album, uh, Safari? Um, Ricky Blaze, mainly I was working with uh, Ricky Blaze. Um, Mr. I Feel Free and uh, my boy Travis Crates. I'm very big on like working with people that I have good relationships with. People mm -hmm. who are like good people. I, I don't really like to just work with people or just because they got a hype name and then when I meet them, they don't have no soul and they kind of look empty in their eyes. Right, right. Right, but you have a relationship with these people so they know the vibe that you want, right? Yeah, exactly. And I'm, I'm more on the, like, I'm trying to, I want you to feel like you're in Jamaica. I want you to be in the Caribbean. I want the island vibe. Where y'all from? I'm originally from Queens, New York, but I was raised in Georgia. Greg is from Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, okay, okay. You ever heard of Grady yeah. Hospital? Huh? You ever heard of Grady Hospital? Yeah. I'm a Grady baby. <laughs> Grady? Yeah, I'm you ever heard of Grady High School? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've heard that too. <laughs> I know there, but I just heard of it. No. So, Savari, how long were you in New York? Because you're really from the island. No, I've been in, I was in New York for practically my whole life. But I was in New York back and forth between Brooklyn and Jamaica. So, like, I would spend, like, the school year 
in New York. And then as soon as June would come, I would go straight to Jamaica and then I would be in Jamaica for the whole summer and I was back and forth like growing up. That's how I was. My I would be in Georgia in school and as soon as school let out, I had to go straight back to Queens, New York, Cambridge Heights. Yeah. So I was between both places, between my family. So Queens is so, your vacation? Queens New York? For the summer, that's where my mom lived, in Queens, yes. In Cambridge Heights. Oh, 229th yeah. in Linden to be exactly. So you know what I'm saying? Me and you kind of the same. We grew up kind of like. You know what I'm saying? I was kind of one of those kids. I went back and forth. We got we got blanket here. <laughs> <laughs> so blanket. Safari, what part of Jamaica are you from? Um, a place called Hanover. Hanover. What is that near? Um, Pondside. It's in Montego Bay. Okay. Um, Lucy. Um, I know Montego Bay. Yeah, yeah. So it's mainly it's like a it's like a town that's in Montego Bay, yeah, but it's yeah, a very small happy. place that if you're not from there, you're not really gonna be okay. familiar with the place. Okay. Go ahead and stop Yeah, of course. So, yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah, got you. We went there. That's why. So, Erica, I gotta ask you: do, Are you gonna do the show again? Are you gonna continue to do the reality show? What, love and hip-hop? <laughs> oh, no, no. This is what I wanted to, I wanted to um, tell you one thing. So um, I would like for you, you could just holler at VH1 and just buy us out the contract, and then we're going to start filming on Bravo. <laughs> OK. Y'all going to do, wait, hold on now. Wait, 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 wait. We might be talking about something. Y'all want to do just YouTube, your, just your life. I'm, I'm, I feel like we need to mix and dibble and dabble. <laughs> We need to mix and dibble and dabble. It don't gotta. It don't gotta be just us. Safari will do. A, he loves reality. Safari, you wouldn't want to do the life of the the Samuel. He'll. He loves reality. He'll do. He'll be a housewife. You'll be over here arguing with us, baby. He loves reality. He loves doing it. I think Safari. That's one thing I love about him is that he just kind of makes the best out of everything. Literally. Where, you know, reality to me, it's like, you know, as much as you want to, like, let things go, sometimes it's hard to because... Yeah, she she holds on to everything. Like, I don't... Like, once I'm done filming, I'm done. I don't film and then hold on to it past filming. I think, because I you are guys. I don't I think, think about it. I think it's because I'm, I, I look at myself as being real and raw. And to me, when it, there's a lot of individuals that come into this and they, they aren't that. So yeah, they come in not, trying to start some shit. Yeah, trying more. to be something they're not. And it's just like, wait, off camera, you're not this. But on yeah. camera, you're this. So oh, it's just, for me, it's like, it's just certain things that I tend to, like, discuss after the cameras are off that he doesn't like. And I'm just like, well, you know. Well, I'm the same, Erica. We might be the same in that area. And yeah, I, you know, just, Safari is a guy. There's a lot of people that yeah. they like to play victim. They like to, like, yeah. have this whole, you know, yeah. whole, whole story. It's just like, Whatever. Do you do you do you enjoy it? She loves it. No, I don't. I do not. I do not. I I don't love it. I've been doing it for thirteen years. I'm over it. No. Uh -uh. You know we're so good. We gotta do a medical adjustment. You know, I think people get confused as that we're good at being myself. So it's kind of yeah. I mean, obviously, you, you go into it, you love it, you do it, you know, whatever. But, you know, you're just so good at being yourself. People tend to think, like, this is something you want to do forever. Yeah, but it's emotional for me. You, you're, like, one reality person that has crossed over in so different ways. Like, I always wanted to act and all that stuff. But it wasn't until I saw you, like, doing your Broadway stuff, your ABC show. that I was like, yeah. oh, so... Even though they try to keep you the, under the umbrella of reality, you can branch out. It's just very hard for us to. Even it when is you're very talented, hard. Even when you're talented. And yes. that's, you know, one thing that, like, yes. you know, it's hard, but at the same time, it's possible. So it's I mean, very hard. so much credit in that because that's something that has not been done for so many right, reality bravo. and scripted and kill it. And then Broadway. It's hard. Yeah, I did. But you know what? I must say, I'm telling you, doing Broadway, doing scripted, doing any of those things weren't easy for me. It was very hard for me. And you know, being in the, where we come from, as soon as you walk through the door, they looking at you like, is she finna start an argument? You looking at them like, that's not even who I am. Yeah. Yeah, and that's exactly what, it, what, what happens. They kind of 
stereotype you. Know, you. They box, yeah, they box you into like, okay, you come with this drama. And it's just like, there's different yes. productions, there's di different cameras. And yes. um, yeah, like my girl Deanna, who like holds down my whole fort, that's one person I'm always like, mm -hmm. I need, I want to be the next mini leaks. I want to do this too. <laughs> like, Nini did it, I can do it. So, it ain't like, easy. Girl, you know, let me tell you something. They try to block it. People try to block everything. It's this, this business is not nice. It's nasty. It's not. It's not. And this is like, good. When people are doing the thing. That's when the reality stuff comes at you more. The brain hey, Greg. Down. Hey, Greg. You wanna you wanna meet me at a bar somewhere while these two talk? <laughs> no, you and Greg are the same people. I I promise. He's not, I can not tell. Worried, he said. We got have we got some salsa water at a bar. Yeah, we can. Oh. <laughs> no big problem right now. Congratulations and their accomplishments. Yeah. But to answer your question, <laughs> you answered it. No, but she was never going to do it again. Safari, I'm serious I'm, when I, I ask you when you guys do a show of your own. I'm not saying you can't still go back and play over at Love and Hip Hop, but you don't want to do your own thing. The life honestly, of honestly, I would, I would love to do that. I just feel like it's just expensive. The networks, you know, networks like it being is fine. expensive. No, the truth For is. Them. Networks like VH1 and so on, they've given other reality stars their own show. And because it doesn't do well, they assume that the ones that actually, the ones that do deserve it, shouldn't get it because of past failures of, you know, maybe, situations. maybe not. I feel like you guys did your wedding. You could easily just spin off into the life of. Yeah. But that's the you can only do, but you can still listen so far. You can still do love and hip hop, and then when that show no, is, you I roll right into your thing. That, but of course, you're you're talking and you're dealing with common sense. Them people, a lot of people, you know how this thing is. People don't deal with common sense. You can do it. Let me talk about that. You can do it. Come on, sip it up. Got some blood clot. No, you really can. No, you really can. Like, I can't stand. Don't tell me you can't do something. That'll drive no, me crazy. No, no, no. I know we can. The rest of the night. You can do it. You can do both shows at the same time. For real. I, I would love to have people who would actually see the, the quality that's presented in front of them and say, listen. Because between, our, you know, our relationship is definitely what... I don't know if you saw the wedding special, but... I did. I fell in love with you guys from that, that show. That wasn't from even your the love. of our relationship. There was so much family stuff. Let me tell you. Hold on, look. Let me tell you something, right? For that wedding special, we filmed nonstop for... A month or two. For like a month, right? Like Every a day. full wedding special. We filmed it. But then when it came to air it, maybe 80% of what was filmed wasn't shown. Yeah. And then it was a big pullback and they just said, uh, wedding specials don't do good, so we're not gonna make it a wedding special and we're just gonna make it a regular episode. So- Wedding uh, specials do great. People love to see love. I, I don't know who, what they're talking At about. At Bravo, but... they think different. VH1, yeah. So it's just always a bad- wedding, child. Bravo have a wedding every year. Yeah. <laughs> love and, a wedding. And, and I, and it's crazy because like I said, like I started to say, like they we gave them so much of our family life. Like I've been on what for ten years, and I don't give much of my my son, my mom, my my sisters, this that and third. I've always been very like you know protective over that side. I just feel like I give so much of myself already that I need mm -hmm. something for myself. So when it came down to our wedding special. I'm in such a great place in my life. I feel like it was the time for the audience to really know who I am, finally. Listen, they got to pay for it. Point blank, period. Listen, we if gave you want it, you got to pay did. for it. They paid for it. We gave it to them. They didn't show it. And I think the disappointment and just how much we opened up and for it not to be used, you know, mm -hmm. that whole thing kind of turned us off on like, okay, do we want to do it again? <laughs> Because well, I, that's normal, though. yeah. But, you know, I, I'm, I'm I'm just looking at y'all because I just know you can have a show. You know, it it, it, it may be normal, but it's not normal for somebody to not want a, a freaking wedding show. Like most people love to have things like that. <laughs> yeah, they know everything you film. They're not gonna keep, right? They only, they only want to count for 20 But at the beginning, they were supposed to be doing a wedding session. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, they should have did a wedding session. The they should have did a wedding session. It was all about us, and then last minute, they added a whole bunch of nonsense sessions.
So I noticed after I did my closet tour that even though my closet looked pretty, it's super dark. So I went on Amazon and I found these little lights in a pack of six. They come with double-sided tape, so you just stick them wherever you want. They also come with a remote control, so they're dimmable. Now I think I need more for my whole- It made no sense to be in our episode. So it was like, okay, cool. Well, that's how y'all want to play it. We know how to deal with it now. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But wow. Beautiful, the wedding, whatever part of the wedding they show. I wouldn't have never known there was most of it on the floor. You guys looked amazing. And Thank that's you. where I fell in love with you guys at from there. Oh, I wow. always liked Safari when he was with the guys, though, when he was like with Ray J and all those guys. I yeah. love when those four guys would get together and just go crazy with each other. I thought that was so great. It was like male bonding time. And then when I saw you and him together, I thought it was a great, great balance for you guys. You Both of you guys are very attractive people. So yeah, you how- You see me? <laughs> <laughs> so how do you feel, Erica, if girls hit on him? How do you feel if, if guys hit on her? I, I'm, I'm a Scorpio, so that kind of stuff just turns me Works on. for me, oh, yeah. Like, you guys want my man, like that. Yes. Like you know, you're that supposed works. to want him. You know what I mean? And I just don't work like for Safari. About, yeah, it's all about him saying, you know, what makes him sexy is that he kind of does it. He knows they want them, but he doesn't give them that, you know, like possibility or that. You know what I mean? So to me, that stuff doesn't bother me, and that's why I think we we work so well together because we came into it. You know, yes. a relationship already built in our own, you know, right, and then right. we're, we just both reach sex naturally. So then we yeah. came together, it was just like, you know, it comes with the territory. And then, like, yeah. look, listen, I'm, I'm, I'm about to be my abs. I'm about to be uh, rock. <laughs> one more time. Listen, I'm about abs <laughs> and being rock hard and just letting people see and know what time it is. Like, I, I like it too. I like when. I like to know that guys is looking at her and pictures of her, and that there's probably a guy somewhere in the world jacking off to her. Like, I, I know nice. that's that's he's what it was type, before I got with her. He's the type to be like, babe, you haven't posted a sexy picture in quite some time. You you falling off. You Word. Fall I off. told like, I told her the other day. I'm like, yo, you posting pictures and you acting like you just some fitness mommy <laughs> wedding. I'm like, yo. <laughs> Throw some like sexy freak shit that you used to do. I don't want to see all of this. Cause I'm like, I'm bored looking at it. So, you know, uh, Savar is a hot mess girl. Hot. Ooh, child. Yeah. You know, said, dancer. don't you, you know what, Erica, you can't let that baby get you there. You know how some girls have their babies, they become like all mommy mo. Safari oh. is like, no, you got to stay put together. That never happen being well, around him, well. ever. When you girls get yeah, have you. their baby, they're like for mad, like mother in a tree. Yeah, you got to look sexy. Yeah, no, he. I'm so, re I'm so relaxed right now. So. <laughs> Greg is crazy. Greg is crazy. <laughs> Yo, I'm looking. I'm looking at the comments. They saying Greg is frozen. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm laughing. They're like, "Yo, unfreeze Greg." <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm real mellow right now. Baby, wait a minute. I got a got a question up here. Hold on one second. Safari can read it. Uh, wait a minute. Oh, there you go. Right there. Erica, will you join the real Oh housewife? my God, if I can hear over and be a housewife, why not? <laughs> You're here, I, Erica. <laughs> I love it. I would so be a housewife. Right you now. hear that ladder with your man? Y'all completely. You know, yeah. I, I got to tell you something, know, Erica. If y'all want to switch over, then people going to beat y'all up. I want housewife <laughs> more than I watch myself. You said, who going to beat us up? If y'all switch over and come over here and be a part of the housewife crew, they going to, y'all other cast going to beat y'all up for that. They going to be like, ah, oh, those mugs are left us. The people who would care are the higher up. That's who we care. Yeah. Not yeah. the cast. Yeah. That's a good one right there, Erica. You can I join the cast. Oh, you have a baby. Girl, but we, we, shoot, we shoot for oh, now our salary is from anybody's, but we we we're so grateful. But we shoot for like six months, girl. Oh please, that's that's nothing. <laughs> no, really? love, love and hip hop. We shoot for like nine, ten months. Get out of here. Yes. Nine, ten months. Nine, ten months of the of doing the sixty nine 
of doing bondage, doing handcuffs. <laughs> <laughs> but wait a minute, how many episodes do they get Safari in the end shooting that long? Well, when you start filming, they'll give you a number. And then as you film, if it gets, if it's if it gets juicy, good, the network adds more. Like right now, this season, it went up to 24. 24. Okay, and it, was that's what we are. it was originally supposed to be 16 or 14. Yeah, so that's And then when the season started, which was the wedding season, yeah, got up to 24. Yeah. Yeah, we're up there. Yeah, we have a lot of episodes. Then we have to take at least two trips a year. So we have to do an international trip and a domestic trip. Ooh. So you have to be down but for all though, of those. Even things. though it's filming for nine months, it's not like it's filming for nine months and our lives are stopped. You know how it is. Like we're still doing our one, two move bookings. I'm doing my shows. We She's can't. doing her movie shit still. So, because I, I see people, I see people right in the comments, they're like, nine, 10 months? That's crazy. It's nine, ten months of our lives being captured. So yeah. it's not like nine, ten months of hard labor. So I was, not, I, was in six, I was in six months of hard labor. The only days we have off is Sunday and Monday. You have to be available every single day after that. And if you have a booking, you have to let them know that you are not available on such and such day in advance. And you got to go and bring your ass right yeah, back. That's pretty much like us. For us, it's like... Our schedule is TBT, TBT, TBT. So you never really know when you're going to be used. Yeah, yes, look at me. Look at me, crazy. Yo, I ain't say froze. Hold on one second. I got to get a question here. They, they loaded me down with the questions over here. Hold on, Safari. Wait oh, a they minute. They're having a fall with Greg. They're like, yo, Greg's froze. <laughs> there you go, you guys. Well, here it is. What oh. if Erica like bear? I'm a hip hop New York or Atlanta. Oh, I gotta admit, I get this question a lot. Like, Atlanta's pretty good. I ain't lying. Let's just put it like this. Just keep it real. I I love the cast of Atlanta. To that point. I love how they come in. They're the, they're themselves. Yeah. Things just organically happen. You don't have yeah. people. You don't have to worry about people like you know, coming in, making up stuff. Yeah. Making up stuff, like, you know, and it's, like, the first day we shot for here, his first t t uh, day shooting was, like, what? About two, three weeks ago before this whole, all this stuff okay, happened. Man. Before they yeah. shot. No, no, he was no, there, no. like, wait, this is a, I love this city, because, like, people are just so bold as themselves. They and are. Like, don't get me wrong, New York is, Nobody will always knows, have a special place cast. in my heart. But right. New York cast and, and the way it, it works, it just feel like it's like pulling teeth just to get mm -hmm. this kind of... They just said in the comments, Erica, just so you know, they just had a comment to go by that says, uh, Safari is fine. Huh? Somebody just put up in the comments, Safari is fine, Erica. So now you can be mad. Yeah, you know what's up? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yo, a, yo, hold on. Show your ass since you talk about them so much. Yo, look, let me tell you, because she's a super <laughs> tech. And I yeah, and Erica like working with the Kardashians. Loved it. I learned so much about marketing, how to make yeah. a TV shit, how you put your name on a t-shirt and you sell it and just make the best of every moment. Yes, it's you do. It's, it's right. part of the platform. It's part of the territory. I did the same thing, Erica. Those I, 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 I really... I they know how to do a it. Water bottle with their name on it. They and do it all now. Sold out like on another level. I learned so much about just how to make shit happen for yourself. So far in Erica, like y'all continue coming back to loving the pop Atlanta. I will come back to. Well, we live in Atlanta. Watch it yeah. tomorrow. Is it tomorrow? You think? Watch it tomorrow and see if we. Oh, so far, who do you like the best, Atlanta or your current cast that you're on? Uh, remember, I was on Hollywood. Yeah, and then you came to New York. Hollywood, New York. Um, I did Love and Hip Hop Jamaica. And, um, <laughs> uh, Ooh, bro, you crazy. I, I, had, I had the, like, I think I had the most fun Hollywood. in Hollywood. Hollywood was just... Yeah. It's, it's because they, they sell a lifestyle. Like, they show the facade of Hollywood, and yeah. they really, like portray that and I had a lot of fun doing it in the beginning and then after a while you know what I'm saying when they started trying to what the hell's that at the top what happened your, your, your phone fell no I'm here I'm trying to get you a punch oh my thing flipped over it's crazy I can't even take my life right now <laughs> I can't take working on the internet period. Like, I, I love making money 
he, I love making you know what money. it is? He it. loves to just go and be himself, and being himself is so over the top. And I, People, I it, it's just so easy myself. to make television himself, with him, and he's so good at just being himself, so it just works hand in hand. And that's why I love Atlanta. People come in, they know what to do. They they they, they yeah, live their life. Yeah, they come. Yeah, oh, you get the seats are done like this. Goodbye. Mm. What's, What's your, your favorite, favorite TikTok, TikTok challenge? challenge right now? Um, of course, you gotta give it to the Savage, right? Hell no. Why? <laughs> um, I like the anything that got to do with Joe Exotic. Oh, the, um, Carol Baskin. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. love it. Oh, okay. Wow. Yo. That Joe, to the <laughs> yo, that Joe Exotic one. That's it's crazy. I'm trying to get him to do it, uh, a TikTok for us. He doesn't want to do TikTok, so. I did one video. Greg, go. I'm, I'm, I'm setting up a porn oh, house. Oh, wait. Speaking of TikTok, you know I have like Needy's doing music now. Me I am. To have safari. Yeah, that's what she said, and she's rapping. Oh, okay, good. Hey, Brian, we might have to do a remix oh together now. You know, I'm yeah. pretty good. We need to pretty get good, this now. We should do a real freestyle. No, no, no. What we gonna do? We ain't gonna let them know about it. We need to get in the studio, and we need to just vibe. You got a studio in your house, or you go to a studio. I go to a studio. Well, I got a studio in my crib. My studio is official. Oh, well, I can come to yours. Yeah, so we could, you know what I'm saying, and we could. We could do the wine time. I have to let you know this, Safari. I work when I go to the studio. I don't play. Oh, I believe it. And what do you think I play? <laughs> I don't know. I, you know, you I, I go play? to the studio and see so many people in there playing. I go in there and be knocking it Yo, out. Yo, like, when I'm I in the studio, I do, it's, it's me. It's me and yeah, the he's, equipment. He's, he's I'm really... not, I, don't, I don't like a bunch of people in there. Me you either. Know, smoking, you know, he doesn't drink. Yeah. Yeah. So he just sits there and just kind of... I zone out. He zones out. He's in there for hours just making stuff. It's, it's, I it's drink, but I don't drink in the studio because I got to work. So I'm just like, I, I know when to have my drink. Yeah, I need to focus. I got to get it done. So, baby, can I hear you? Is your thing going? Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. we hear you, Greg. We okay, now. So, how long? Yeah, I'm froze. <laughs> <laughs> how long have you all been married? Huh? How long have you been married? Um, almost a year. Oh, that, that, that explains newlyweds. <laughs> Yo, Greg, you got to get in the studio. Yeah, we have to get in the studio. She had no idea what kind of meat I was working with. So when she finally got to get the meat, <laughs> it was like, okay, let's oh play. God, Erica. Let's Listen, play. This is good, Erica. I remember when he said in the episode, he said he used to dream about you. I thought that was so cute. He he would text me when we first when we first kind of we did this show called Scare Famous. But mm -hmm. before that, he had like ran into me at the Mondrian in Miami. And when we mm -hmm. finally came on the show, mind you, we didn't know none of the cast and who was going on. That whole time, we spent a lot of time together. But I just thought him coming at me was part of the strategy of him winning this game we were on. Long yeah. story short, every day after that filming, I would wake up to a text by him saying, I was dreaming about you last night. I was dreaming about you. <laughs> I dreamed about you. But you know what? But you know what? I was doing all of this, but I never, I never really thought that like I was gonna get her. So it was like I was going mad hard, and I was just like, man, I'm gonna just keep on doing this, but I don't think anything's ever gonna come from me. I didn't think she was gonna take me serious. But then, when it got sloppy, it got serious. <laughs> I knew oh, you were gonna get somebody, Safari. I, I've been watching you for a while. I knew somebody was gonna get you. I mean, it took the right girl to get you. Erica was a good one for you. He, he got me. I, I have to say, he, he <laughs> got me, that's for sure. So y'all, do y'all talk a lot to each other at home? We spend so much time together. We're together 24-7. All the time. It's like, he'll be But do you there. talk a lot? It doesn't mean he'll be, he'll be being together doesn't mean anything. Text, I miss you. She said he she he'll be downstairs, hello, and she'll get a tag. But do you so, physically talk to each other a lot? Oh yeah. We talk about every and anything. And we like, talk, but sometimes she what? You don't pay attention. Sometimes I'll, I'll say <laughs> and I have to say 
said, yo, you hear me? Yo, you hear me? And when I do that, she hates it. She hates Ooh, when I do Which one of y'all talk the most? You said which one of us talked the most? Uh-huh. Safari. I, I think probably her when she's complaining about me. About stuff that I do wrong. I'm trying to figure out all the newness. I'm in awe. So see, uh-huh. you, 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 want, you guys can finish each other's sentences and shit. And all yeah. the newness, all the newness is dripping off of you. And, and you talking about what you're dripping? What did you say? The newness. Oh, that's the newness, dude. It was dripping earlier. Yeah. But I feel like you be asking, oh, what's the difference with all being married? I, I really don't feel like it's a super crazy difference. I, I get to wear this on my finger. This is I enjoy this. This is very yeah. like, you know, see me a mile away. And uh, real new. He really don't wear it with him. I got yeah. one right now. You brand new. Oh, damn. Oh, damn, Nini. <laughs> yeah, Erica's crazy. ring is pretty big, too, now. Nini, Nini, do you know yeah. that there are hungry children in Africa? <laughs> Let me see that. Hold it up to the camera. The camera, you got to go up. The camera. Go up. Oh. Oh, man. I don't know where That's it is. Turn your hand around like that. <laughs> <laughs> Turn your hand around. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> Erica's ring is pretty big too. It's a lot yeah, of parents over here. I feel I feel good like when she goes places and like people who don't know her and they like see her ring and they're like, wow. I'm like, that's what I want. You son of a bitch. You know to- <laughs> so why are you crazy? I that's got ring that. the yeah. oh, so far as diamonds, like like he's a woman. He loves diamonds. I do too. He I, you could you guys. Yo, I remember. You know what? I remember years ago. You remember the Felipe Chow in um, L.A., the one on Wilshire? Yeah, that's what. What's his name? He's on Manny. I was part owner in that, right? Yeah. Um, and I remember you had came there. I remember I had on these big ass earrings or big ass chain, and he was like, "Oh, those are some big diamonds." But, <laughs> you know, at that time, the thing I was wearing it wasn't it wasn't real. So I was like, "Yo, was she trying to play me, or did she?" <laughs> play me? But did she think it was real? I had some, I they were I had some real. big fake shit on. And she was like, oh, those are some big diamonds. I was like, oh, no, they no, were remember, real. Remember when we were in Hollywood, uh, the Hollywood Hip Hop Squares, how she walked in and everyone just got quiet? It was like, everyone was like, me, easier. <laughs> she just walked in, she was like, hi. Just Hello. Like, and everybody was just like, so cool. Everybody's looking like, Oh my God, that's me! Oh my God! Yeah, hello, and girl. Listen, I be I'm the coolest of fans. I just oh, come in. Hey, I'm just. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me ask you a question, right? Because being in the public eye, I know you have a lot of you can relate to walking through an airport and people coming up to us and wanting to greet us and all this, right? Moving forward with this whole coronavirus situation, do you feel like you're gonna be able to move the same when people wanted to approach you? No, honey, they ain't gonna be able to approach me. They can barely approach me now. And for real, they ain't. I'm gonna have my mask on. I'm scared. I'm very sensitive. I don't want to catch a cold. I don't need anything. I need to be able to work. So just wave from across the room. That's fine. Do you need to be up close up on them? Yo, when people see me, like, they feel like they know me. It's like girls. Yeah, they do that to me too. I don't like that. They'll kiss me on my neck. They'll try to put their hand down my pants. Like, they be Uh doing craziness. And I'm just like, now. I gotta cut all that off. Right, people walk up to me and they ask me sometimes, can I hug you? And I said, why do they want to hug you? Why? You can't do that now. You can't do that, Safari. It's too much. Now, when when we first got on lockdown here in, in the U.S., where were you? Were you out of town and you had to make it to Georgia? No, nah, I was in Atlanta. We had oh, just okay. had a baby like yeah, a month ago. We had just had the baby, so we couldn't go nowhere. Yeah, we couldn't go oh. in the house. I and it just got worse and worse. And then once they finally shut down production of the show, that's when we knew, yeah. like, okay, I'm serious. It's so serious. We're doing our own green screen. Do you cook? Yes. Yes, sir. Now, I wouldn't cook in my, in my real life. I mean, she's a southern woman. I would not be cooking. But because we're at home, we don't have no other choice. They used to pee pee when they see me. <laughs> 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 What? I'm sorry. Listen, I, I know how to cook, but I will only cook like doing yeah. Thanksgiving in yeah. New York or New Year's. 
that's like that because there's only three of us here that's me and Greg and our son and they eat he's 21 he eats he do whatever and he oh, eats so something they different they cook for themselves. he's 21 so he just do whatever how old is your grand baby now she is seven that's she funny. is seven that's I got a She's a, I, mean, she's a girl. I, 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 want, I want a nanny. I need, I need a... You can get a nanny. Don't, you know you need a nanny now. You got to have a nanny now, Erica. See? Exactly. You do. I'm you do, Erica. She's like, no. We need Erica, this. listen. If, even if she only came two days a week, you need you need it, too, just so you no, can have a break. No, she be here every day and live here. Yeah, well, Why? see that? I think because it's new to him and he's so set in his ways. Like, he's he's in his 30s. He's never had a kid before. I've done this before, and I know... I've done but what about when you want to go on a date, Erica, with your husband? Let exactly. me talk to Portia. We have family. Mm -hmm. But let me talk to Portia. Portia went through a service and something else. She ended up doing something. I can't remember. Let me ask her. But, you know, Portia lives around the corner from me. And so she has someone that's with her all the time. So she can tell you something that's good. I, and there I is one lady. In oh, you do? There's one I lady that works with all I of the families like, out here. She's a the Spanish lady. Well, this know, is the second and time. Even that, it, it, you know, me being young and single, there was a lot of sacrifices I made. And, you know, I missed out. Yeah, but Erica, the, the, the nanny could be with that. you. The nanny could go out with you and him, and so you could see the baby, and she could just be there holding it and things like yeah, just a you couple know what? times. She likes to watch a lot of like crazy shows, like on IG channel. So she thinks that the nanny's gonna come and try to steal the baby or or cut the baby <laughs> up or do something crazy. I'm like, yo, we can have a nanny that could like you know when we want to do our stuff. I'm like, a, some... I'm a bronx girl. I never thought. Growing uh, up, really, I'm gonna have a nanny. We right? live in a different lifestyle now. So. You there? You live in a different lifestyle. Now I'll kick the baby for a hey, couple you. hours while y'all go out too. I love babies. You yes, mind. yes. I love the babies. I love when they start talking. That's okay. You can have it back. <laughs> I like me. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely watch the baby while you go on the date, though. I love me a little baby. You go on the date, the baby be right here in Casa That's a good way for us to get in her gig. Casa Lee. Yo, 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 you be going, you ever went to, um, what is it, another broken egg? Is that it? Yeah. I'm sure she was, she's gone to go home. there. Uh -uh. What's it See? called? Another, another broken, broken egg. egg. It's what are they saying? It's a breakfast know. spot. It's, out, it's, it's in your area. There's only like two or three of them. I need to go there. I've never been there. And I'm not a breakfast person. Yeah. No? Their food's really good. I love breakfast. I can have breakfast any time of the day. I love lunch. Yeah, she's very greedy. <laughs> I love to eat. I love to cook. Me too. I love to eat. He likes to starve himself because of his. Abs. Yes, his six pack. His six Listen, pack. let me tell you something. If I don't have abs, I don't have life. Stop it, Safari. Are you vegan? No, he needs to be. I'm not vegan, but I eat clean. Okay, you do eat meat, though. Whoa! Can you pay us a meal? Hey, yo! Come on, Nene. <laughs> you eat meat. Easy. I, when I said meat, I mean like burgers and steak. If, if I'm having a burger or a steak, that's like a once in a while kind of thing. But I'm really a chicken, fish. My son is, on a plate. My, my husband's very vain in, in certain aspects and what he eats and how he looks is That's majority. good though. That's good. You care good. about yourself. If you don't you care about to. yourself, how are you going to I'm care about others? I believe it, Safari. I'm with you, Safari. I preach this. I, know, I, know you care I about preach yourself. this. Yes, I care. I preach this all the time. I'm like, you got to stay looking good. That's why I'm telling you, I'm gonna keep the baby for a couple hours because you got to dress up, put on the dress with no panties, and go on a date with this man. And I hold the baby till you get back because yeah, you got to. You cannot sit there and cl clench your damn hands and be with Safari and his six pack. Look at Erica, like fuck that. I'm staying at home. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. I mean, I'm, out. I'm very, you know, spontaneous. Every once in a while, I might come up the shower with some lingerie, you know, contact yeah. on, be a home. But, you know. but, but Erica, you young. You got to go on out. Y'all got to go on a date. When we be able to get <laughs> back out. We like to travel. We want to travel dates. I'm my, my husband, me too. My husband. Uh-uh, did we free? My idea of going out doesn't last long. He don't drink, so it's like once he's tired, we gotta go home. So 
it's just that I just put all this on, all this makeup on to be up out for an hour and a half. We, look, going out doesn't mean we're going to a party. Going out, it I doesn't like, mean it could be. We we'll like, go to the mall and he'll be like, I like bar, I'm lounge, I like bar, too. I like lounges, I like to shop. Me stuff too. Like that. Bars, lounges, you don't go to a bar. Don't lie for her. Like, and you don't go to a bar. So what about one time? That so brand new. One time, me and her, we went to this spot where, like, they they do penis molds. So I went there to get my my joint molded. That was and a night out. But it, us it was, to get his penis molded so that he can admire how big his penis. No, 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 that's not what it was. So called. it becomes a night. Where they do that at? Where they do that at? I want to know where that's at. It's, it's we'll messy. Text you, we'll text you. It's a very messy procedure. It's messy. It's hot. It's clay. You got to mix it. And the timing is crazy. Because when you mix the clay with the water, you have exactly about 15 seconds And the whole time, there. I got to make sure he's aroused so I can get the proper mold. That is crazy. Where are they doing that at, girl? I want to go there. I want to go see that. I might want to sit and see if I can see my Hello Kitty. I, you know. Yeah, they do women, too. They do women. That's nice. I might want to do that. Well, do they have extra long? They have extra long. They got extra long. They got everything. Yo, the joint. And then I you get to pick the color that you want your mold to be. So, it's so like what color is your mold, Safari? Nah, we had tried it out, and it was like there was like a peach mold, and there was like a black and brown mold. And I'm not gonna lie, when we did it, it got messed up. It just messed Man, up. After all of that? Because I right, look, this is a perfect example. Perfect example. You see this thing right here, this big hole? It's like this big, so you gotta be like this inside of it. And <laughs> it gets the whole thing. So but, even gets the ball sack. And then you gotta wait till it dry and then pull it off. I do it have a bigger bowl. I would need a bigger bowl. <laughs> I need a bigger bowl. They have, yeah. Yo, that was the issue the first time because the bowl. I need a damn kind of, foot tub. A foot tub? Oh, yeah, you need a foot tub with this mold. That's the bird is like yeah, shit. Yeah, I'm walking. <laughs> <laughs> I bring pain, baby. Look, Safari say, "Yikes! Now you walking." <laughs> I bring that heat. Safari, what you say? Safari's like, "Yo, what the hell, boom!" Safari, you say, "Yo, how you walking?" <laughs> well, I just walk where right he's skipping. That's she all. So, so long story short, that's our night out. You, you been, been sitting in my mind. number for an hour. No, 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 not for that. But if he was gonna go to a lounge and listen to some music or hey, a hey, nice girl, restaurant, I, I want to travel. I want to go to a beach where I can Me be too. oiled up, nice sneakers with some shorts on. Oiled up for what? I love to travel. I love to travel. For your what? You love to travel too, oh, Erica? Traveling. Go to my oh, I love traveling. I love traveling. I, Hold on one second. We, you know what's crazy? I actually started traveling more so when we Go down with right? Because I actually have. Right down, down. I'll go back to it. He wants to show. I send you a picture. We already been on that right there. We did that question already. It popped up. Hold on, let me see something. Okay, where Greg? This is what my husband oh, sends me every day. Hold on. Yeah, because you know what? Um, I don't know why they put that. But I don't know what it says. Where are you going to? Oh, okay, there they go. Safari. So, oh, Safari and Erica, when are you going to show the baby? <laughs> I don't know. We, we we don't have a set date. That's just, just something I that don't know. if I... it happens, it happens. Um, you know, the people at our VH1, they've been asking us the same thing. And I don't know. I just feel like in this day and age, people are just so wicked. People are just so evil. I don't, want someone, I don't want people taking a picture of my baby and then doing voodoo to that picture. I don't know. People are just it's, weird. It's, but uh, look, yeah. just, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. Can you see? <laughs> yes, I can. Okay. So You're look. way smaller right there, though, Safari. You're not that skinny. Look, so look, let me tell y'all something, right? I can't wait a minute. I'm going to show you my fit. I'm going to show you my shit. He's showing his? Let's go, Greg. Let's go. Yeah, we're going to have a picture phone. 
Let's go. Let's go. I'm, I'm going to show you my shit. Let's go. Right he's he about to show you his abs, honey. You you wait for it, honey. You hold on, honey. Hold on one second. You gotta go all the way through your phone. Oh my god. We got to we 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 were faint by the time you find that shit. No, we're back to oh. the question of This was after um, breakfast earlier. Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm Here we come. Hey, I just listen, because I seen somebody the other day say, Oh, he had a baby and he fell off. He don't got his cuss no more. So that's for you, hater. Whoever that Okay, was wait a minute, hold on. Okay, go. Where let me see. Are you about that one? Yeah, Greg. Oh. Greg's it. That's Greg. Wait, is that a baby or you? Look close. Look. This is hilarious, Erica. That's Greg. No, it was not. That's like a meme. It's hilarious. Look, Erica. Look, Erica. Erica, somebody is saying they agree with you. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm scared. I'm, maybe when she starts talking. Hold on, maybe. let me see. Mrs. Maybe. AJNYC, kindly keep keep that to yourself, okay? Thank you. <laughs> he only wants her, Heidi. He only wants a nanny for his sexual purposes. No, no, no. I want a nanny that when we're out or do anything or go everywhere, the baby be with the nanny. I don't want when we're out doing stuff. People walk up to us when I got the baby and stuff like that. Like, I just don't want that. It's part of being a parent. They already answered that they want more babies. Yeah, yeah. Show which one? Oh, here go, Greg. Hold on, now who got it? Look at it. Look at it. Oh, okay, Greg. You see? You can't, you can't top that one. I've got you this week. You got to make a bigger plan. Now who got it? Don't let me smooth that fool, you know. Hey, don't let your smooth day fool you, Safari. I'm packing. All right, look. <laughs> we're going to link up. And we're going to do, we're going to do a side-by-side. I'm, bringing, side that, I'm bringing that pattern. Safari, you, you have to come you over here, Safari. Have a good time. We're going to do a side-by-side -side picture, all right? Everybody. We can do it before and after. <laughs> okay, it's so far. There they go. They asked Eric, me so many questions about Erica and went to push. Sorry. Was it really love at first sight with Erica? You better it's answer that. Um, when I oh, well, you just trying to get some sex at first. It wasn't love at first sight. Nah. Yeah, were you trying to it get it? No, 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 no. It definitely wasn't sex because I didn't think I could get it. Let me tell you. The first time I saw her, I just was like, I couldn't believe like how beautiful she was, right? Mm -hmm. Then, when we filmed the TV show where we had to live together for two weeks, when we got there the first night, the thing was, when we woke up the next morning, she, like, I was in the kitchen, and when she walked out of her room, and it was early in the morning, and she had no makeup on, and she just walked out and went to the kitchen, I was looking at her, and my jaw dropped, and I couldn't believe it. And I was, <laughs> with my, I was with young Jock and Don, and I said, yo, I said, bro, she don't got no makeup on? I'm like, nah, son. I said, there's no way that's how she really looked. Mm -hmm. And then from that point on, I mean, he was right hooked. On, on the road to insertion. <laughs> Go ahead, Eric, you got him, girl. I love it when guys chase girls. I hate, I always tell people that when the girl chases the guy, that is the wrong thing to do. I, the guy must chase the girl. He must I want to chase. I, I chased her ass and she ran. I chased the shit out her. I ran. I remember that. I see 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 Yes, God. It was over. It was talk over. That talk that talk, right? I was so ah, Look at Safari. <laughs> Safari. Talk that talk. <laughs> Safari. Good, Erica, you know. <laughs> I'm, I'm used to it. Erica, you're going to be in trouble. You are going to be in trouble fooling with Safari. Yo, I swear yeah. I'm about to get my coconut oil and oil up on y'all. <laughs> Here you go, Safari. Safari, how did you feel when you first found out you were going to be a dad? Well, that's a good question. Did you cry? 
Were you nervous? Did I cry? Well, we were pregnant twice. You know what? I was okay. very excited, but the second time around, I was scared because the first time she got pregnant, I think like in seven or eight weeks, we had a miscarriage. So yeah. after that, it kind of discouraged me. And then when she got pregnant again, I just was like, I was happy, but then I just was like, uh, let's see. Yeah, and, he like waited to show his excitement. Cause she was high, she was high risk the whole time yeah. because the, the doctor said something about me being able to reach too far up. The doctor said, no. I know that, I know <laughs> that. The doctor was like, safari, there's no way you can use that whole thing. So. You give him a sore throat. Erica, safari <laughs> crazy so again. He said, Greg said, safari, Greg said you're gonna give her a sore throat. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Greg, what kind of hobbies are you into? Do you, do you shoot? Are you into watches? What's your hobby, Craig? Watches. watches. Greg yeah. love watches. Oh my God. I love watches. Let me tell you. All I do all day is I look up and I study watches all day. Love I'm watches. A, I'm a watch fanatic. Do you golf at all? Yeah. <laughs> I've never golfed. Huh? That, that should be something I you should feel the dance balls off the That's core. That's a very classy man hobby to have. Well, they golf in my backyard, so I would think that somebody hey, like Sorry would be out there. That's true. But they have a golf course and that whole rich. Yeah, I yeah, live yeah. on the hole. Rich people. Rich people. Rich people. That's, and listen, oh, that's, that's baby talk. Babies not crying. That's baby talk. <laughs> Safari, I live on the hole, so they golf in my backyard. Uh, the people out here are going so throat, so throat. That's hilarious. Safari, you're going to get Erica a so throat with all of that you got. A sore throat. She has a very big mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Erica. No, oh y'all know, know she has a big mouth. Oh my God. Erica, they're asking you guys, what's the name of your baby? You never told it before? Nobody knows her name and no one's seen her face. And they don't know her name, they've seen her face. Okay, take it out. Um, her name is on my ring, if anyone can really? see it. Really? Oh, who did picked the name? Know. Did you pick her name or did Safari? Uh, we collectively did. Yeah, we collectively. Yeah, it came first. From... Her name is amazing. Um, Don't say it, just wait. I call her. Okay, then her. Erica, you, I mean, mean Safari, you guys wouldn't do an article like in People Magazine and show the baby like everybody does and, and just show no, the baby. I think, no. I had, a bad, uh, I had a bad experience. I used to show my son, and yeah. it was one time that my son wasn't with me. He was actually at a library with a few of his friends, and he got bogarted with like a whole bunch of women, like female yeah, we had. Yeah. And it traumatized my son to the point where he does not ever want me to take a picture, and he's scared I'm gonna post him. And I think that whole thing just kind of shook me because it's like my our kids aren't always with us, and if they, you know, are I don't want something like that to happen, and I'm not there to protect them. And yeah. I've traumatized him enough where I'm very scared as far as like putting my kid out there. Again. Well, that kind of happened to us too with the Glam baby. It, we people knew that she was mine, and she was going to this little daycare, and she was got a little bit older, and there was a lot of parents there, you know. Yeah, waiting it's outside. So, it's so crazy yes. how parents it was are, different. older people are so intrusive to a young kid's face. And it's it's just yeah. knowing their parents aren't there and just mm -hmm. feeling like they're obligated just because they're fans or whatever. Um, it, it's just it's just so crazy. And it, it it was sad for me because it was other parents doing it to another to my child. And it's yeah. like, what if it was the other way around? How would you feel about that? But I think that you guys are gonna be fine. You'll yeah. be fine. But you wait and show your baby and talk about your baby when you yeah, ready. Yeah, I feel like I should, you know, time goes on. There's so much going on in the world right now. I feel like there's other stuff for us to start to talk about. Yeah. Yes, it is. So, so uh, Erica, is there anything you want to plug? Um, nothing really right now. I think what's um important, I feel like, is what's going on right now in the world. And I feel like we should all, um, be you know mindful that it is a crisis going on but it's we have to be very positive there's so much that we need to be grateful for at the same time we need to do what we can 
um, as far as, you know, donating whatever we could, reaching out to people who you know may not be as fortunate as you because there are a lot of people who are like losing their jobs, who don't have ways to get by right now. There's a lot of yes. children as well too who, um, you know, school is their safe haven. If you know any yeah. child in particular that, you know, you know doesn't have the healthiest home or safest home area, please check on that child whether you're an uncle or friend or a neighbor. Um, there's just so much stuff we just have to be aware right now of. Um, and uh, just to, you know, just just keep our, our faith and be positive, um, stay home, wash your hands. Yeah. And, um, yeah, we're gonna get through this. And I think um, little things like this helps the time go by, but at the end we have to come together and realize that there is stuff going on outside and we have to be mindful <laughs> <laughs> and, um, Keep on our little feet. Look. And, yeah, and, and just you know, consider all the things that are at hand. And like I said, if you know friends or family hey, that are not, what are you talking about? What's going on in the world right now, Safari? It's not about your. She's just doing all that new daddy shit. Um. Yeah. So anyway, we just gotta really be considerate right. and help those who need help, especially those that you know of, because we all know someone who's going through it whatever way you can help and just you know let's just stay home so that we can get through this and get back to working again yeah we're ready to get back to work as well yeah. i think that's a great way um i talked to safari earlier he talked about his song and things like that i love for he and i to link up i honestly will keep the baby so you can go on yes, a date really and come over here to costly do this because we yes. are neighbors and now we yes we are so you have to come Washington. over here and i'll take you for a tour so you can know that our home yes, is safe I Yes, we have a safe home. I've been in Atlanta for so. like years, and I've passed you, and I'm always like, I love, I'm dying to go into that. It's like the forbidden, rich, you know, <laughs> land of the unknown. You know what I mean? No, it is not, girl. You're oh welcome anytime. If anybody anytime. knows what I'm talking about, they know. Like, yeah. that is just like, oh, my God. Who live over there? Who lives over there? Yes. So I'm going to send you... Uh, my personal information when we log yes, off to here, okay? Hey, don't, yeah. don't don't forget to check for the four million. I won't. Four million is a damn lie. Safari, Safari you're welcome to come over and play in our hole. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, the golf. What is the golf? The golf hole. The golf hole. Oh, okay. <laughs> do you do you do you play pool, Safari? Yes, yes, I do. So we have pool. I, I do everything that yeah. deal with balls. Wow. He does too. Uh, that deal with balls. He wait. does too. What are we gonna do with these guys? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, no, I definitely don't. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah, yeah, thank, thank, you. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Set it up. I am. I'm gonna do it right now. I'm gonna do it right now. Okay, one more. I love you guys. You guys are beautiful. Y'all so, y'all so, cute. Grace said, y'all so, do y'all are cute. Bye, guys. They're about to the cute couple, though. Sexy, beautiful. Okay, you guys, listen. Hey, you guys, it's me, me, and Craig. So, we're going to make sure we send all of our stuff to Safari and, um, and Erica, I can't, I, I can't wait to keep the baby. Like, I'm the baby lady. I'm going to hold the baby, shake the baby, put the little bow in the baby hair. Yeah. What's I love up, Brad? What's up, Brad? T-shirt Brad. Oh, hi, Brad. What's I haven't up, seen you in so long. Brad. Yay, yay. Brad is in there. I didn't see you, Brad. Yay. So it's been, um, uh, uh, I, I, what I was saying is we have our boys. That's all we've ever had here. They're all, no one's here, here but Greg and I and, and, our, and our baby, youngest. But so I love a girl. I have my little glam baby who's seven. That's the only little girl. And so I love to, to have a, a little girl to hold. So Safari and Erica can go to the broken egg. I don't even know what the broken egg is. You seen it? It's over here somewhere. The broken egg? Yeah, it's a, it's a breakfast spot. You know, we don't do breakfast. We don't usually go to break. We go to a brunch maybe because I'm not a real breakfast person and Greg only likes to have like coffee in the morning and I don't even have coffee, but sometimes I'll have a hot tea. I have so. a coffee and a coffee. So you guys, I have to say thank you. And listen, tomorrow at 7 p.m. I have Dr. Oz. 
So Dr. Oz and I will be on live together at 7 p.m. talking all things coronavirus and health. So if there's anything you want to ask Dr. Oz about being safe and healthy during this time, you know we are about to hit a peak. And that's when things are supposed to get really, really serious and everybody needs to stay as safe as possible and stay inside of your house. Wash your hands often. Um, mop the, the traffic areas inside of your home. Spray Lysol or some sort of disinfectant. Use Clorox, whatever you can that's a, a strong disinfectant. And if you need some Lysol, holler at me. I got the connect. Greg says he has a Lysol connect. Who ever thought we'd be walking around needing a Lysol connect? Lysol connect. But um, I'm interested in Safari and uh, in Safari and Erica having their own show. I am interested. So mm, I'm going to talk to Erica about that. I, I think it'll be good to do, do something together with the kids, with the new baby and everything. So um, you guys, don't forget tomorrow night at 7 p.m. with Dr. Oz, my good friend Dr. Oz and I. We'll be on talking all things coronavirus and health. I have a few questions for him, and I'm sure you guys do. Um, every time I'm around, well, not around, but I, I, in, my, in my room every now and then, I feel like, did I just get the chills? Like, I feel like everybody is paranoid like me. So um, Greg said he has this light saw. Connect, DM him. Don't DM me, child. Baby. It, only if you live around here, I guess. I don't guess you you shipping off lights all like you. Baby. We end up ordering a lot of lights all. So Ooh. let us know, you guys. Thank you. I love you guys. Greg, cut it out. Oh, please. Cocktails and conversation. There's just no rules here. Until another night. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, I wanna sip and eat pasta, baby. Cause you're hasta, baby. Yeah. I said you're hasta, baby. Only thing I think will make you hot, baby, is if me and you go hit a hot, baby.